Hi kids! Isang matatag na araw. I'm Sir Noy and welcome to Mat Bilang. In this video, you will learn how to solve problems using data for at most two variables in a tabular form or in a single line graph. First, let's solve problems using data in a tabular form. Solve this problem using the following data. A small juice stand recorded the number of Buku juice bottles sold over 5 days. The data is shown in the table. To solve this problem, let's answer the following questions. How many bottles of Buku juice were sold on Wednesday? Thirty bottles. On which day was the highest number of bottles sold? Friday, thirty five bottles. What is the total number of bottles sold in five days? One thirty eight bottles. What is the average number of bottles sold per day? One thirty eight divided by five is twenty seven point six. Rounded to the nearest whole number, so the average is twenty eight bottles. Another one. A weather station recorded the high temperature each day over a week. Let's answer the following questions. On which day was the temperature the highest? Thursday, 38 degrees Celsius. What is the average temperature for the week? Approximately 30 degrees Celsius. How much did the temperature drop from Thursday to Sunday? Six degrees Celsius drop. Let's try. Solve the problem using the following data. For number 1, in which week are the most units sold? Week 4, what is the total number of units sold over the 4 weeks? 210 units. What is the average number of units sold per week? 52.5 units. Now, let's solve problems using data in a line graph. Here is our line graph. Let's solve the problem using the following data and answer the given questions. On which day was the highest temperature recorded? Thursday, for 45 degrees Celsius. What is the difference between the highest and lowest temperature? Thirty degrees Celsius. What is the average temperature over five days? Thirty-three degrees Celsius. 
another data. Let's answer the given questions. On which day did the store make the highest sales? Friday, 6,000 pesos. What is the difference between the highest and lowest sales? Four thousand pesos. What was the total sales amount for the five days? Twenty thousand pesos. Let's try. Here are the answers. Activity time. Activity number one. Solve problems using data in a tabular form. Here are the answers. Activity number two. Solve problems using data in a line graph. Here are the answers. Always remember, when solving problems using data with at most two variables in a table or a single line graph, remember to carefully read and understand the data given. Identify the two variables and how they relate to each other. Look for patterns, changes, or trends in the numbers. Use basic math operations like addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division to answer questions about the data. Check if the problem asks for the highest or lowest value, the total, the difference, or the average. Always double-check your calculations and make sure your answer makes sense based on the data given. Thank you so much for watching! 
please subscribe to my channel and like my Facebook page. Happy learning!